Ken, I also wanted to ask because, uh, you know, you sneakily are also on a very popular uh, TV show that was first on YouTube and then now on Netflix called Cobra Kai. You just yeah. you snuck in on us there playing uh, Armand. You're the, uh, the landlord, you know, going to these, uh, you know, wealthy country clubs. And you were in the first two yeah. seasons. Can, can, what was that? Having lobster. Having lobster. Let me tell you. <laughs> they said they want you to do this YouTube thing. All right, YouTube thing. That means YouTube thing. There's a lot of young people. That's good. I'm semi-old. So that's good. I do something with young people. I said, what is it? It's something about Karate Kid. I said, oh, I like Karate Kid. I remember Karate Kid because I took my kids to see Karate Kid. But these guys got to be older. So I went over there all the way. I'm an Armenian guy playing an Armenian guy who lives in the valley. And I'm playing somebody who lives in the valley. And I go all the way to Atlanta. And there we're having lobster for lunch. I'm staying at the best hotel. I'm I mean, I'm being paid a lot of money. I said, listen, this this is supposed to be YouTube. She says, ah, but it's Google money. I said, okay, it's Google money. I did the first season. Then I went back for the second season. Then I went back for the third season. But it was on YouTube, the first two. So I, I watched the episode that I was in. I told my kids, watch the episode. So, when it was on Netflix, I'm telling you, I binge watched both seasons in less than four days. That was all I watched. Right now I'm doing it with West Wing, but I had already seen West Wing. But this, I just thought they were, it was just so well written and well acted that I thought, okay, I'm, I was in, but it's nothing, mean nothing. They were great. The storyline's great. I cried watching scenes that I was not in. I mean, I, I, and then they had scenes with uh, 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 Miyagi. And I'm not supposed to tell you this, but my son opened up a CBD store. And it's not open yet. It's, they're still working on it. But it's called... Mr. Miyagi CBD, and all of his first customers are getting a bonsai tree. Oh, wow. I mean, I, I love the show. I thought it was so well done. I, and I'm, I've already uh, called them and said, I want to take karate lessons. I, I, I want to, more or less, I'm saying I want to be more on the show. That, because the show is just amazing. Yeah. So. I offered. Let's see if they take me up on it. Yeah, no, that's that's amazing because yeah, I mean it was on YouTube Red originally, and um, I mean I binge watched the first season, the second season when they came out on YouTube, and then they just arrived on Netflix, you know, a few months ago, and then it's like to everyone, it's a it's a whole new show. But I was like, I've been telling yeah. you guys about uh, uh, Cobra Kai, and we're so lucky that uh, season three is coming out in January. So we don't got to wait too long. And we're so lucky we're shooting season four in a couple of months. Yeah, yeah. It says season four is uh, yeah. back in training. I know the uh, creators and writers wrote that they've outlined uh, the first uh, or the 10 episodes and that now they're going to start script writing. So that's, that's exciting. Yeah. I, I, I told them I want to learn how to play karate. But on season three, you'll see that I got my ass handed to me. <laughs> and I don't remember which which guy, but after the scene was shot, I went and I said, "Hey, that's not right. He just he's not paying me rent. What is he doing? He's not." I would go because I went there with two Armenian guys, and we didn't get what we wanted. So I said, "Listen, if this was the valley, I the next scene is forty seven hundred Armenian guys," and I was told. You'll get your revenge on season four. Oh, I wow. said, okay. I'll wait. That's, that's so, awesome. So, now nah, they're, they're, and the kids, wow. Wow, I'm jealous. 
I mean, especially this one kid that started in the uh, the bad guys dojo, and he's uh, he's fantastic. I I think the the acting is superb, and and really, uh, I did a a movie called Price of Freedom, which was about the Shah of Iran, and the Shah was played by Paul Servino, and the revolution came, and there was this one guy who was a mullet. I think that's what they call him. And he was just like a judge and he would kill people and have these people, their head chopped off and stuff in the movie. Man, I didn't know it was Martin. He, it, he was so, the, the acting was so good that I didn't know it was Martin. And then when I saw him, I said, hey, I, 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 I bowed down. You were great. He just, he was so good. I didn't know it was the guy from Karate Kid. And now he's back on Karate Kid and he's doing commercials for tax credits and stuff. So it's worked for everybody. It's a great show. What's amazing is, um, I mean, it's, there's a very uh, popular phrase, um, you know, between you and Johnny, you know, this handshake deal that you guys had that Crease eventually took over. And that's how we got the, uh, the dojo. Um, but I don't, I don't know if you realize this, or maybe you do, but in uh, Ray Donovan, I think it was episode five, uh, that w episode was called Handshake Deal. So that's why when I, when I heard about that, um, I was like, yeah, and Ray Donovan, and then in Cobra Kai, Handshake Deal, it's just, uh, I, I don't know if those two had anything, it's just something that I, that I noticed between the two. Only a movie buff like you would know that. I, we're like, do this scene, how am I acting? Let's go next. But that's great. I didn't know that. And that, that's a good, uh, good way for the two producers to introduce Ken, the handshake deal. But, but still, I got my ass handed to me in the last, uh, in the third, end of the third season. And I will have my revenge. Oh, I, can't, I can't wait to, uh, to see that. And I wonder... Uh... Wonder what's going to happen if uh, if something that Johnny's involved with or if Chris gets his revenge. I'm I'm excited to uh, to see it. We're we're almost there. A few more months to go. Yeah, 